Hey guys, so I thought I'd uh, do a vlog just on a bit of a day-to-day -day stuff, what I've been doing. Um, of how I sort of, I guess how I sort of structure it out. Um, I usually work from home, running all the social media, emails, um, just work off phone and laptop and whatnot. Uh, so there's not really much to film with that. Um, but tomorrow I'll be going to the shop and... Um, yeah, just day-to-day -day runarounds and getting, getting shit done. So, um, yeah, I, I don't even know off the top of my head. There's a lot of shit I've got to do tomorrow. Um, so I try and, because I'm living about an hour away from the shop now, I try and plan everything, uh, try and squeeze as much as I can in one day. But, yeah, a lot of, uh, I've got to organise a lot of charity stuff, so, like, print off um, novelty checks, Organised permits, times, meetings. Um, what have we got? Got to drop off the clubby, get some new tyres put on it, get it ready for the new owner from the raffle. Um, what else have we got? Um, got to see one of the boys, get a deposit and some parts and stuff for a trim. Um, I've got a hair appointment done because I fucking... Let myself go here a bit. I don't think I've had anything done to my hair since I dyed it pink, which was ages ago. Hopefully Range Rover's ready. Um, I'm getting all that color coded and painted. Um, hopefully VF Malou's ready. Got that, uh, got some engine work done at APS. So, I mean, in between that, I'm sure there'll be bloody 100 phone calls and little bits and pieces and stuff I've got to do. Um, but yeah, might not be anything crazy, but we'll see how we go, see how much I can get done during the day and hopefully get guys get a little glimpse of the runarounds and the, the bullshit I do. But uh, yeah, otherwise, pretty much I'm here, just going through the calendar, communicating with the boys, suppliers, the shop, marketing, uh, doing campaigns, um, yeah. It's all, it's where it all happens in the, uh, fuck, I lost my couch. Still waiting on another couch. But yeah, it's where it all happens most of the week. But tomorrow, I'll take you guys around and show you what I'm, what I'm doing. So, I've been up this morning. I sort of um, put my alarm on for whatever, 6, 6.30, and then I'll spend a while just writing back to um, DMs and stuff on Instagram. Um, Mrs. is still asleep, so I don't know how to fucking do this properly. But um, yeah, I usually spend like an hour, or hour and a half every morning just replying to people on um, Instagram and stuff. Just like to try and get back to everyone. Sometimes I can't. Um, fuck. Why are you doing this? And then, um, yeah, try and get back to everyone as best I can. But um, sometimes like when heaps of stuff's going on, there's just too many dams, like it was just something crazy. Um, yeah, I can't really get back to everyone, so. But yeah, I usually do that for about an hour, hour and a half, try to get back to everyone and then sort of get the day started, since I won't really get to throughout the day. Hey! Uh, I've written back to cunts. Um, I shouldn't say that word. I've written, not for a vlog used to Instagram. Start again. I've, uh, I've written back to everyone on socials, had a coffee. Um, time to get to work. Oh, fuck. Bit hard to vlog, didn't want to wake the missus, eh? Fucking first thing in the morning, hear my dumb head talking shit on the camera. <sighs> okay, 
This is a bit where my neighbours probably don't like me. Oh, shit. I wonder if I can like, set this up, have a bit of a chat. I don't know. I don't know if that's working, eh? Just gotta be real stealthy in and out. This car rumbles the whole bloody house. <clears throat> there you go, I did it. It's all about quick speed in and out. I'm in uh, Dandenong 
So these guys we come to for tyres. So even though we sell wheel and tyre packages, we'll generally get our tyres from these guys. So this shop is just fucking out of control. Uh, motorsport wheels and tyres. We'll go in and see the boys. We'll park up. Check out this joint. Like full little work areas, lounge room, heaps of wheels. Sick little like kitchen area, fucking kids corner. We have a look at your rough sketch. Looks mad, eh? But this place is actually ginormous. Um, but yeah, definitely goals to have a place this big. This is fucking, be mad to have an eye candy this big, I tell you that. Oh, fucking, every time I come here, I love this joint. So many bloody wheels. Everything's like always like spotless clean. Awesome like waiting area and stuff. Oh, time to get to APS. New tire time. We've got fucking big Azza. <laughs> Eating his nuts. Oh. Uh. Where are we going? Back to work. Is this thing electric or what? Uh, sometimes. <laughs> Just checking if the Malu was all good to pick up. Yeah, you can pick it up, yep. Oh, I'll get a lift down now from Dandenong, so it'll probably be 15 minutes, 20 minutes. Done, mate. I'll talk to you soon. All right. Thanks, mate. See you, bye. Fuck yeah, get the Malu. It's got, um, I've just taken it to APS. Um, done exhaust, cats, injectors, um, underdrive pulley and tune and stuff so the LSA should be going a little bit better now so we can uh, take that for a bit of a test drive fuck there's a smash up here this was oh yeah I saw those trucks yeah we're fuck I'm excited to drive this thing so not this driveway but in between here see just here yeah She is. Nice and moist. Off to a good start today. Got the car dropped off. Um, and getting tires sorted on that. As it picked me up on time. Now I'm APS. The car's ready. Hopefully it starts. Sweet. Car's done. Um, time to go to work. And I've already forgotten the next step, so I'll jump on my calendar and see what else I've got to do. But, uh, fuck, she's foggy today. Oh, there's so many cars here. There's my baby, the GDO. Alright, see how this thing goes. So, <clears throat> it already feels better. But the main point I said, uh, I just want it to sound more whiny because I, when I got the LS, like it's got an LSA in it, but it's stock, you can't even hear the supercharger. So hopefully now with the pulley upgrade and stuff, you can hear her whine a bit more. So I'll just give her a little, put the foot down a bit, see how she sounds. Shit. <laughs> I'm a happy man because that sounds fucking cracker. <laughs> oh, stop it. I actually really, 
like this car a lot more now. Uh, might have to go to Mexico. We'll save that for Instagram. Um, so I've just rocked up to work. There's a fair bit going on, but I'll sit down, grab a laptop, plan out the, the rest of the day. Fuck, this is gonna be sick. Next raffle car. This thing is a absolute weapon. So there's some Lou, she's all good. We're doing so many X classes at the moment. Just blackouts. Everyone wants blackouts. All the black wheels, side steps, roof, backs, badges, handles, and grills. <clears throat> This time you're just creeping around. Ah. So yeah. Well, get started on the day. Hey. Can we on camera? Hey. Okay. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> Are you filming? Yeah, I am. I'm just vlogging my day to day stuff. This is Jess. Hi. She's the. <laughs> Receptionist, phone girl, PA, you'll probably speak to her, not me. So, just doing a bit of a. This was actually your idea, the yeah, um, daily, vlog. daily vlog, day in the life. So, the office where we have a bit of merch on display, wheels. Is my turtle still alive? Barely. Oh, God. Where is he? I don't know, I've got a turtle in there somewhere. I think he's burying away. Yeah, a few different things. People can pick all their colour for their interiors. Um, wheels, wrap colours. It's all books here, different wraps and everything. Um, yeah. Ah, oh, this is the office. So my brother will be up there doing all the designing, printing, sticker making, vinyl, whatever, to wrap cars and trucks and walls and whatever. This is Anita's little situation. There's a bit going on, a bit of merch and stuff. Um, then Triff does all the videos, whatnot. Dan, who's a manager. I don't really have a desk anymore. I've been kicked out since I moved home, so I'll just sort of use Anita's if, if she's not here. All right, let's have a look. So... Man, these Apple calendars are the best. So yeah, I'll pretty much just go on here. Um, so I picked up VF Malu, done. Uh, picked up, dropped off the car for the tires. Oh, I got hair at 10, so I got an hour to get this fucking wig sorted. It's bloody getting out of control. Um, I've got a few meetings today that I would really like to squish in if I can. Oh, I'm supposed to be getting the Range Rover. Let's see if that's gonna be ready. Hopefully. So, I've got a guy that I use for, he's colour coding all the body kit, so he does all my panel work. Hopefully it's ready. Hey mate, how are ya? Yeah, good mate, how are you? Good, what's happening? Oh, fair bit. Bit, yeah. bit on. Yeah, yeah. I was, um, I was just touching base to see if you had an ETA for the Range Rover, just so I can plan stuff yeah. around. I'm gonna, I'm putting it back together the Sarbo. Yep. Um, we had to repaint it because when that the plastic sort of second hand goes real furry, you gotta paint it for it. Yeah, the raw plastic, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. otherwise it looks shit. So, um, the boys are slow coating that this morning and then we'll put it back together the Sarbo. Yep. So that'll be right to up tomorrow at any stage. Alright, I'll, I'll touch base with you tomorrow and then we'll plan it out. Yeah, too easy, mate. No stress at all. Alright, thanks, mate. Have a good day. Bye. Right, oh, big trips here. Um, oh well, Range Rover's not ready, so I'll probably try and grab that tomorrow. But 
like you said, I'd rather him just take a bit longer and get it done properly so it looks mint, there's no rush. Um, and yeah, we'll get through, try and get through some more stuff before I get my hair done. See how we go. So pretty much now, I just gotta set up. Um, so for the raffle handover, I'll be leaving here Wednesday night, um, staying in Bendigo, then we've got to get up in the morning. Um, I've got to organise some novelty checks to hand over. Um, the Australian Horizons Foundation's uh, organise a press release for a handover at Bendigo. Hopefully we can get some media coverage. Um, then in the, from there we'll leave, head to Bathurst, um, and then hopefully get uh, some more media coverage there, handing over the car at Mount Panorama and stuff. So a lot of um, flights, accommodations, um, logistics, I guess, that to, to be organised and the press releases and um, get all the checks sorted and liaising with the charities and stuff. So, yeah, next, today and tomorrow, trying to just get all that locked in so that um, it all runs smoothly. So just pretty much sending off emails to everyone, just confirming all that. Um, Jess, who you met earlier, she's already organised all the flights and accommodation. A um, little bit of a pain getting out of Bathurst because it's a, a small place and obviously there's not many flights at the moment, but hopefully that all goes sweet. Um, but yeah, I'll probably just do a bit of emails and stuff and then I've got to get down, get my hair sorted. Oh, we're here for Ranga. Frankston. Fuck this traffic. Oh, I haven't had my hair done in so long. I'm a little bit excited. It's fucking gone out of control. Man, these fucking cars are red. Oh, this is where the magic happens. Cafe, Cafe, Capelli. Oh, I just call it Maxi's. Maxi will sort my hair out. I can never say the name. You gotta be in it too. Me? Yes, this is my hairdresser. Look at her hair, it needs doing. <laughs> Alright, now we're blonde again. Um, I should book in, eh? I don't know what I normally eight. That was eight weeks, I reckon. Yeah. Um, so we usually doing four weeks when you're cut, and then um. It's all fixed. I'm blonder than you. Look at that. I'll give you a run now. <laughs> oh, lost a few hours there, but it's all part of it, isn't it? Got a fucking look fresh for Bathurst. Look at that thing. Oh. All right, I've skipped breakfast, so I'm fucking hungry. So I'm gonna try and get some lunch sorted now. Might right, see what the missus is doing. Action. Action. Um, show your face. We're going to lunch now with the missus, aren't we, babe? Yep. That nice. We're going to Shanika. You're gonna say hi. <laughs> show your face. No, I'm camera why? shy. Show your face. Shut your face. Do you want to see how the new LSA goes? Okay. Oh, that's why you want me to show my face. <laughs> Go! Oh, that makes my stomach drop. <laughs> that nice, baby. Pretty happy with it. Pretty happy. <laughs> drop her back um, so now I'm gonna go and visit um, Maddie from Breda's Liquor so he's a 
a distributor for most of the liquor to all the bottle shops and pubs and whatnot. Um, but they've just got on board to be a snorkel distributor. So we can get the snorkels into a lot more bottle shops and stuff. So got a bit of a meeting with him to catch up. Um, yeah, we're heading there now. He's just in my estate, so it's good. It's nice and close, easy. Oh, that's all right. This is all that's left because I keep doing too many snorkels. Down to the last few. I should have brought, I should have just load up the whole pallet, say. Eh? <laughs> yeah, so this is where all the snorkels happen. All right, so that's one meeting down. Um, just remember, I still have to go get the VF when the tires are ready. So I'm just finding out when I can go pick that up. Um, what else have we got? Oh, I'm gonna get some paperwork ready now for the VF handover. So just like transfer of ownership and receipts and everything. So when I go up to Bathurst, um, that's all in the car ready to go. So I might jump on the computer and get that sorted. So these are some checks that were just novelty ones, um, obviously, because real ones aren't this big. But these are some checks we're handing over on Thursday morning in Bendigo. Um, so this is just uh, one of our charities. We've got Otis Foundation for breast cancer. Um, and also the Rotary Club. Um, at Bendigo, so Rotary Club help us distribute all the funds to the farmers and whatnot um, in the droughts or whatever they need. So we'll just be taking these up Thursday morning, get some photos with. Oh, so I'm here with uh, Sammy Lamarca and he's in a bit of a pickle. What do you reckon? With what colour? So he's got the maloo, loves the white, but want to mix it up, change it up a bit. Um, we want to stay with the silver wheels. So probably keep silver badges, silver wheels. So trying to pick a color that's going to look classy with all that. But uh, you just realize how many colors there are. <laughs> <laughs> There's a few, bro. <laughs> like, that was that one? Yeah, I feel like if you go on the effort to wrap, like that color is sick in the sun. Yeah, that flakes, man. Yeah. I don't know if you go into the effort to well, might as well change it. Like, like that looks like full super show. Unique. Yeah. New tyres. Actually fit pretty good. <laughs> no, I don't do that. Oh. Another task done for the day to um, get this bad boy back and see what else we got left. Surely we're getting to the end of it. Uh, so that worked out good. Um, Sammy came down, um, wants to wrap his car. Uh, a lot of mates do it. They just they sort of got a colour in mind, but they always want to catch up and just go over it and just get my second opinion, which is uh, I guess makes sense because it's my I'd like to say expert field. Um, so you always sort of have little, uh, I guess, consultations here and there with uh, mates and regular customers and stuff. Um, just go over their car and come up with some ideas and themes. And, you know, people say, oh, if I go this colour, should I go these wheels or should I do this or should I do that? So it's always good to sit down and go over with them and just um, get them all 100%. And then he was going back towards the city, so he got a lift back to the clubby and that worked out all right. Um... Now, I think I've got to call a couple of people back. There's a couple more things I've got to do, but I'll, uh, yeah, I'll suss that out now. That looks sick. Security, Jay. Uh, so now that's crossed off. Um, only a couple little things left. BF Clubby, Sammy, 
Right. Nearly there. Fuck, new VT. Yeah, but um, we just need to re... How's the Altezas? <laughs> Fucking <laughs> schmicko. Nothing but the best here. Nah. Yeah, so it's got a spare. I like, definitely well, need a spare. Well, it's got a... Oh, fuck, got pins in there. Yeah, make sure you grab your jumpers. Need them it's probably point. worth more than the car. Yeah. <laughs> um, Sick. You just need to re-beat it. That's why I took it off. Oh, okay. Yeah, otherwise it's practically fucking... What a weapon. I left some soy sauce in there for you. Yeah, in case, <laughs> just in yeah. case we run through Maccas and... Yeah, you get some sushi, you're ready to go. <laughs> fucking oath. Oh yeah? yeah it's a manual you didn't have to do that for me bro. <laughs> I'm not paying extra for that. Does it start alright? Did you give me the key? Um, I've already lost it. Oh, here you go. I'm keeping the photo, eh? Oh yeah. That's the goal. That's been my inspiration for the last <laughs> six months. This is why you keep driving this car? <laughs> 100%. Oh it's got a fucking SS dash or some shit. What's the white dash? Dark. Fuck, is it got exhaust? Yeah, it does. I don't know, I think <laughs> it's either a rusted hole or somebody spaced it. I don't know. I don't know. We've got yeah. fucking mad head unit. Yeah. Soy sauce. Yeah. Bit of inspiration board. It's, it's a ripper. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is perfect, bro. Does the job? Yeah, man. Well, can you see how far it gets? I mean, if we get through a whole day, I'll be really fucking happy. Like, I was gonna say, yeah, I reckon it will, but I've seen some of the shit you boys put it through, so I doubt. <laughs> yeah, we'll see. Fuck. I was leaving that sneaky little surprise out for you guys, but yes, did secure a, a VT. Really fucking happy about that. So, uh, obviously, another vlog coming up soon. Separate one. What a weapon. Look at this little bit of bog here lifting up. It's alright. Do you want to christen it, bro? You gotta, you gotta hit the front guard. <laughs> it has to be a good one, though. Right, right, right there's good. No, you need accuracy with the barefoot. <laughs> Fuck, I don't know if I want it actually. No returns. <laughs> now, now you see why I love it so much. Oh yeah. Feels good, huh? Fuck. Now I don't want to sell it. <laughs> don't judge. Let's see. <laughs> no, it's not going to start. He's hit it, hit it too good. That's a good footprint, man. I'll better fix up the other side, eh? Don't know if I can record him. Yes. Just makes him so much tougher with that. Oh, Alright, checks are printed. Then we've got. Um, just like the. Can't see. Acknowledgement form, so he just needs to sign that to show that he's collected the car. A receipt. We'll get this ready in the VF. Ah. Um, and then I think I've got to go to the bank and then pick up. It's about 6.30, so I'm running a bit behind schedule. Got to um, go to the bank and then I've got to go see a mate, pick up some cash for his trim deposit. Oh, fuck, she looks good. Definitely miss this one. Right. There we go. Alright, 6.30, so 12 hours into the day since I've been riding back to Tex in the morning. Um, it's been pretty non-stop talking with people. I mean, even while I'm getting my bloody hair dyed, I'm on um, you know, Instagram, Facebook, DMs, emails, whatever. So we're doing pretty good. We've got a lot done today. Um, now... I'm going to, fuck, it's all good hopping in the, you can work a big day and then hopping in the blue just makes it all fucking good. 
Um, oh, love the sound of it now. Fuck, it's responsive too. Cracker. Anyway, let's go see my mate Guzzo. Because we're going to get some trim sorted for his um, Beamer and his FG. And then bank, and then home time. Can't wait. I don't even know if you can see me now. It's probably pretty dark. All right. Getting to the end of it all now. 7.30. Pulling in home. Fucking ready to wrap it up for the day. Hopefully. Anita's cooked dinner, so I'm absolutely starving. And I just remembered that I've fucking been giving this car hell with slabs in the back. So I'm fucking. Hopefully, we haven't smashed these bloody slabs. Oh yeah, the button's a bit funky, isn't it? Oh god, can't smell cruiser. Yeah, I'm fucking turn some lights on. They all feel full. Um, anyway, yeah, so with the interior, um, trimming my mate's parcel shelf, and then I've just got his console lid to match it off. So, just like a can you see, like a red leather double diamond stitch, do the parcel shelf, and we're gonna do his beamer in it the same. So, that was the last thing. Oh, and I did the banking, so. That's a fucking day. Check that LB. Ooh, ho, ho, ho. Me scooty. Come on, hopefully dinner's ready. Is dinner ready? Yes. Got everything done then. Everything went spot on. Look at this little chef, little master chef, mama. You go. Right, well, that's pretty much that's pretty much wrapping up for the day. I guess I'll um pretty much sit down, have a meal. Um, might watch some fucking TV with the missus and then probably um, jump on the computer and plan out then the rest of the week. Um, so, I don't know, as you guys can see, obviously I can't record everything during the days because I'm, I'm busy as fuck, so I'll just try and record as much as I can. But the days are really like back to back. Just one thing to another, no, no real time to sort of rest. So when I'm doing that sort of stuff, that's where I fall behind in my Choi Candy stuff, my snorkels, my, like all my other businesses. I've got a lot going on that people don't even know about yet. But yeah, like the ECM label, the, um, these sort of days, I don't get any chance to work on that. So I'll have like these days where I get all the shit done that I need to go out and do, and then I'll have a day at home where I work behind the scenes and get like the marketing, the campaigns, the new products and stuff like that. So hopefully you guys enjoyed it and um, gave you a bit of insight to what I actually do these days. So yeah, I mean, it's not too accurate. Obviously every day is different. There's a new little thing to do here, new stuff, but gives you an idea of the little tasks and stuff I run around and do.